Hey everybody, welcome back. Aaron Explores. Aaron tries it so you don't have to. This tasty gem, which is made by Palmer Candy, gummy bear, gummy berries. Nobody, I don't think anyone has ever liked these. But I'm gonna give them a shot, because why not? I actually picked these up. I'm against the Mississippi River right now, it's beautiful. I picked this up in Cape Girardeau, which is a little convenient uh, spot in a, a rougher edge of town. And um, I always love going in there. The guys that work there are really kind, really friendly. And, uh, but I like stopping in places and, and, and saying hello to folks. Plus the guy that was in there, his name is Rads. I want to get a shout out to Rads. Thanks, man. Um, thanks for your kind words and, uh, and watching. Thank you, sir. I appreciate it. Um, and thanks for the goodies today to be able to show to everyone just exactly how del delicious or not so much that they are. But without any further ado, let's try this and see how it is. You all know that I start out by smelling it first. That's just how I do it. <laughs> so, smells like somebody got into the Christmas punch. Maybe. That's actually, it's very red. It smells really red. Um, all right, I mean, you know, Christmas punch. And we'll start off by these things have the Palmer candies. They're like big, I don't know, big sugary dots stuck to really crazy, squishy feeling gumdrops. And we're gonna try it. It bites back. I mean, that's like, like movie theater 1957. You gotta get that. The red one was a little weird, but it wasn't terrible. All right, let me mutilate this bag so I can get to one of the blueberry wrap. I don't know. But that <laughs> I'm sorry. That one didn't taste very good. Maybe I didn't <laughs> try again. That was, okay, Palmer candy gummy berries are definitely not the way to go. Not for me, but you know what else? There's something else. I am so thirsty that I bought some Palmer candy, that's right, baby, wax bottles. Ooh, they don't have any kind of cool grape goodness in here, but, oh man. It's a very red kind of day. I am so thirsty. I'm gonna wash these big sugar filt these things out. All right, see ya. We're gonna split that up. Man, you gotta really fight to get that out of there. That's like, <laughs> it tastes like, a jitney jungle. Ooh. This got a blue one. It looks like a Coca Cola bottle. These are not. That tastes like Halloween 1987. You know what, man? That was fun to try those two, but uh, wax bottles. Cool for nostalgic purposes. Not very good at hydration or washing out the bad candy that you tried before. Hey everybody, have a good day. Thanks for watching. That was fun. Here we go. I 
I've got the first item here. And I've already opened them because I realized the first video I made, well, you couldn't see anything. So these are made by Palmer and they're gummy berries. I've seen these in candy dishes around Christmas time on grandpa like in grandparents' houses. So Christmas, 1957 or something. So we'll try one of the red ones, because dingle ain't red. definitely fights back <laughs> and these little balls fly off everywhere I mean it smells very like they smell red that's like some kind of some kind of gumdrop they put back together after it didn't go so well last year I'm gonna try one of the blackberries I love blackberries That had to go. Oh my gosh. I got my eye. Ooh, gummy berries. They attacked your eyeball. No, not for me, ma'am. These, you know, some people out there, they might like these. But they're not. Not for me. Palmer, gummy berries. Some may like them. Next because I'm so thirsty, same company, and I opened them as usual, like I said, wax bottles. These used to be nickel dip, but I think 7-Eleven likes it, they can stop that. It's blue, right? I am so thirsty to wash out those things, those drops with ball, uh, here we go. Ooh. Pop the top off. It's like those barrels that you get at Jitney Jungle in Mississippi. <laughs> That's a lot of goo. <laughs> I got some people over there listening. I'm sorry, <laughs> nickel dip, but it's not really, it's generic. And Sykeston, we call it Buddy L. I've got an orange one, so here we go. I have to keep that lid in there this time. <laughs> kind of shot down the What are you supposed <sighs> When I was a kid, I used to love these things. And I don't understand why. <laughs> but, hey man, wax bottles. They really didn't satiate my thirst, and they certainly did not wash out the nonsense of the gummy berries that are not bouncing here and there and everywhere. These are the gummy berries. And these are the... Nope. So, I just wanted to thank everybody for watching, um, and have a good day, and I'll be back with more adventures on explorations and trying these little niceties from gas stations and goodies from all over, all over the place. So, see you guys soon.